Learning how to hire the right employees is hard enough. Keeping them is even more challenging. But what happens when they fly the coop? We spoke with Susan Ratliff from Exhibit Experts, a trade show display company who learned the hard way the cost of entrusting vital company data to your employees. Well, employees certainly are a huge factor. Uh, it's not so much finding the good ones, that's, that's difficult, but it's keeping them loyal to you. I have had uh, difficult instances where employees, after long terms of working for me, have left my company with my database. Uh, I had two just last year who had been employed by me for three years, uh, left and started a competing business down the street and took my administrator with them. So, <laughs> so I don't know what the answer is for that. I have uh, incentive programs, we have a very flexible schedule uh, for the employees, uh, although they're not extensive benefits. Uh, they have a high uh, commission rate, uh, sky's the limit for what they can accomplish. I provide them with all of their materials, uh, join the organizations to allow them to network and find new business, pay for all the advertising. Uh, so I guess they've stayed for me for years, but it's just getting that loyalty. It doesn't seem that uh, employees nowadays are really loyal to you. I guess putting controls in place, like for the database, for example, have you put something new in place to security measures or anything? Well, like I had a 13-page employment contract, and I had, you know, files locked, but uh, she came in on a Sunday and stripped the account. <laughs> yeah. You know, how do you prevent that? Because you have to trust. You have to give them the key to the place of business. Uh, I think one of the issues with my business is that I, I hire salespeople who have the entrepreneurial spirit. And sometimes you, you can't really fault them for having the goals to go out and be better than, you know, than they are. Uh, so on one hand, I have to encourage that. But on the other hand, it shoots me in the foot. <laughs>